So I talked about manifesting in one of my latest videos and I wanted to go more in depth with that with the help of one of the books that I just finished reading. I seen the book before. I didn't really know what it was about and I wanted to pick it up but I haven't bought it so I bought it off Amazon. It's called You Are a Badass. You Are a Badass. How to Stop Doubting Your Greatness and Start Living an Awesome Life. That sounds fire. But in this, and it took, took me like a month or so. I don't speed read. I like to absorb what I'm reading. She talks a lot about manifesting. So I looked up the definition of manifesting. It said, a display or show of someone's act of appearance or appearance. How you want your life to look, where you see yourself moving towards something, where you, um, where you want to be in the future. Uh, this is also from her book, which I love. I love her book. Tells you, 10 out of 10. Change your thinking first, then the evidence appears. You can't be so focused on the how. Everything will unfold, but on the what, and be willingly open to figuring out and receiving. So from that, I came up with four tips for myself that I tell myself and remind myself every single day, every single week, because I, I mean, we all want to grow. We all want to manifest something beautiful for our lives. So we have to work on it in the physical sense and work on it in the mental sense of staying focused and having a clear vision of what we really want. So one is get clear on what you want. Um, two is ask the universe and the gods to receive these things that you would like or the life that you envision yourself having. Three is put your ax towards it and trust the process. You have to have faith in yourself, in the manifesting process and in the future that you are going to receive these things, that these things are already yours. They're on you and the thing that you're going for are coming towards each other when you're manifesting and reminding yourself every day, every week, every month that it's coming towards you, that you're working towards it. Step by step, you guys are getting closer and closer to each other. And four is acknowledge and be grateful for what you receive and keep your vibes and energies high. So normally what I do to keep my vibes and energy high, I light a candle, I cleanse my crystals, which I'm still learning about crystals, so don't quote me, but I cleanse my crystals with sage, paleo wood, and incense, the smoke and the sunshine and the full moon. So that's every month or twice this month. I always wake up every morning and acknowledge that I'm in the place that I am. I'm super expressing my gratitude for how far I've come and what I have currently. And I'm expressing the gratitude and acknowledging the stuff and the things in my future that's on its way towards me. I love reflecting and I love gratitude because I'm so grateful for where I've been, who I've met, who I've encountered, what knowledge and wisdom I've absorbed from them telling me their experiences. It's just like, I don't know, it's just the energy for me. It's the energy for me. <laughs> it's the energy for me, but I always express gratitude. I tell people I love them. You have to remind yourself that you love yourself. You feed your body the things that you love. You drink your water, you're charging gallons or bottles. Every day you have to express gratitude and acknowledge everything that you are, everything that you're going towards, and everything that's coming towards you. I hope that kind of clarifies my version of what manifesting means to me. Uh, let me know in the comments if you guys have any questions or you want me to talk about something else. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. I know I haven't shown my face on here, but I am doing all of the work and I am giving it my all.